Yes, hello guys, welcome to another edition of Sports Update Ghana. My name is Joseph Adamafio. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Like, share, don't forget to leave a comment. So, as we build up to the 2023 African Cup of Nations and Ghana's preparations for this particular tournament, well, yesterday we saw Coach Chris Hilton announce Ghana's final 27 man squad for the tournament. Well, some surprises in the squad. So, Thomas Partey not making the squad for the first time ever since Partey decided to choose to play for the Black Stars. Now, Partey has been injured since October, ever since he played for Arsenal after their game against Man City. And he has been nursing his injury and we're hoping that Thomas Partey could return to the pitch in December. Unfortunately, Thomas Partey wasn't able to recover fully, although he has started training with us now well in the 27 man squad released by coach chris hilton it didn't include the vice captain of the blasters that is thomas party well speaking after naming ghana's 27 man squad for the afcon coach chris hilton revealed why he decided to leave thomas party out of his final squad for the tournament uh, thomas party who um, for sure and i and i Say this not in a detrimental way to the squad that we have, um, but he's one of our most important players. This, this we know. Withstanding in his injury, he certainly would be in the squad. We know that. We know the quality of the player that he has, that he is. Um, but this is a player that has a substantial injury, and I've spent a lot of time over this period of time with Thomas and also engaging with the medical staff at uh, an Arsenal football club. And they will treat this, this injury with caution. So, so will the player. This is a, a big injury for him and the biggest injury that, that he's had. And um, the most important thing for me as, as head coach um, uh, and Association is to give him the support that he needs um, through this period of time. From all the information that we've been given, the timelines of his recovery and the caution that it will take will not meet our timelines for Africa. So apart from Thomas, we have... Um... So that is Black Stars head coach over there, Chris Hutton, explaining why he decided to leave out Thomas Pate in Ghana squad for the 2023 Africa. Well... Aside Pate, one of the key players that we are going to rely on at the 2023 AFCON is Mohamed Kudus. Yes, the Western man has scored about 10 goals since joining the Hammers in the English Premier League. And Mohamed Kudus is one of our key players that will be relying on to do very well at this year's 2023 AFCON. However, despite being named in Ghana's squad for the tournament, Coach Chris Hutton revealed that Mohamed Kudus has picked up a slight injury and, well, the West Ham medical team are seeing to it that he can fully recover and join the Blasters in camp. Speaking after naming Ghana's final 27-man squad, this was what Coach Chris Houston had to say about Mohamed Kudus. Mohamed Kudus, who I think we are expecting him to join the, the group, hopefully, hopefully in a, in a few days. He has a very slight, very slight injury and issue that um, just needs to be dealt with before he joins camp. We're hopeful, hopeful of having a <coughs> So that is Coach Chris Hilton touching on Mohamed Kudus and the fact that he will be joining the Blasters later in camp and he has picked a slight injury which is not that serious. Well, in the squad that was named by Coach Chris Hilton, it didn't include two of Ghana's renowned uh, players, that is Abdul Fattah Isaku and Baba Rahman. Well, Baba Rahman has come out to explain why he decided to exclude himself or drop out from Ghana squad for the 2023 AFCO. Now, mind you, Baba Rahman since 2015 has been in Ghana squad for almost all the squad that has been named, except for the particular tournament that he got injured and couldn't play for Ghana at that particular tournament. Baba Rahman has played almost all the tournament for Ghana. He has played about 15 matches for the national team. It was expected that he would be part of our left backs for the 2023 AFCON, but unfortunately, Babaraman did not join the team for the 
2023 AFCON. Well, the player went on social media, that is X, to reveal why he decided to exclude or drop himself out of Ghana squad for the 2023 AFCON. Let's check that out. So that is Barbara Man explaining why he decided not to join Ghana for the 2023 AFCON and wished his teammates the best and hopefully they get to win the trophy this time on. Well, that's how we draw down the curtains for this episode of Sports Update Ghana. It's your boy Joseph Adamafi and it's always a pleasure to come your way with the Sports Update. Do what subscribe to the channel, like, share and don't forget to leave a comment. And please make sure you join our WhatsApp channel so that anytime I post, you can get a notification on this and more. My name is Joseph Adamafiu. See you in the next one. Please subscribe.